after the meet that I just finished, took a couple days of rest, and now we're back at it. Uh, this is going to be the new gym that I'll be training at. There's our 93 kilo national champion. Uh, this is also where Steven Cassioli trains at, who just broke a world record squad in the IPF, as well as some other very, very strong people. Um, I'm just doing a quick six and a half to seven week training cycle currently, aiming for a meet uh, a few hours away, but I'll be able to stay over at my cousin's house overnight and make it that way. Uh, I don't plan on getting too much stronger. It's just, it's a short cycle. I mostly just want to nail down a proper squat and a proper deadlift. I came up 10 kilos short of that deadlift that I, that I locked out. I was just stupid and lost air. And the squat attempt, I was just stupid and took 180 kilos when I should have probably taken something like 177 and a half. Uh, what you just saw there was my last set of squats that day. Just did 70% for three sets of five. I think I got bicep tendonitis, so that was hurting quite a bit. And I actually felt like throwing up in the end. Uh, and I had to quit, or... Yeah, I felt like throwing up and I just quit the workout. Um, week one, day two, that was today. That is Randy Yi, who just squatted 551 pounds at 183 as a junior. Uh, and I think he just came short of a 600 pound deadlift due to grip. Uh, back there, that is Derek. He squatted 500 pounds of meat very smoothly. Uh, what you're just seeing there were some sumo deadlifts, five singles at 70%, followed by bench, five triples at 70, at 70%, and then block pulls, which I've never done before, uh, three sets of six at 75%, and here's the final set for that. I'll be training here for the next few months at least, and I'm looking forward to it quite a bit. Hopefully this bicep pain can go away within a week or two. I can get back to it. It's affecting my squat and the bottom half of the eccentric on my bench press. Uh, we'll see how the rest of the week goes.